Welcome to Lisa Marvin Art and welcome to the big Earth Day collab. I'm very serious today with my glasses on because this is a very serious subject that I've been stressing about because um, the whole theme, obviously, of Earth Day, reduce, reuse, recycle. I have been collecting canvases for years of things that I'm like, okay, it's not perfect. I can zhuzh it up after with something, you know, like hand painting or whatever. And then I never do because I never know what to do. So I have like 20 or 30 pieces laying around that have been sitting forever um, that I've always said I was going to fix. So this is a perfect opportunity. And I say this because I don't know if I could pull it off or if this is a good idea. Okay, let's discuss. So I love, no, I do love Dutch pours. I'm not doing this. I love Dutch pours and I've been practicing. I'm definitely not an expert. Um, but when I started learning, uh, I was playing around with different things and I always liked the flow, but the end result, mm, not so much. Okay. So in this video, I'm going to show you one that I did that I love the colors. I love the flow. Um, but it definitely, as it dried, needs to be zhuzhed up. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but like, it can't be that hard, right? It will be hard, but I wanna show you what I did. Let me know what you think of the colors, and then um, let's see if we could fix it up and get rid of some of these canvases that have been uh, piling up for years. <sighs> Wish me luck. Okay, I have no idea what's gonna happen, but I've thinned down my colors-ish enough. So let's talk about what we're gonna use. We are gonna use Triart Rose Gold. It's one of my favorites. Then we have Amsterdam um, Permanent Blue Violet. Then we have Amsterdam Prussian Blue. Now this is, I actually mixed a TLP. This is um, Agapanthus and I mixed it into US Floatrol. Um, I probably, I don't remember what I did, but I probably um, thickened it up. I mixed it with some gel gloss to make it more substantial and then added it to the US Floatrol. I have my TLP Sea Glass. See how glossy it is? I don't know how it's gonna react, to be honest. We gotta give it a try. One of my favorite colors, this is Liquitex Gouache. This is called Fluorescent Violet and we have 24 karat gold. You'll see better in a minute. Okay, what I actually wanted to do for so long and I haven't had time, but it's the perfect opportunity. I got a bunch of different golds in the tube paint and I wanna compare them really quick. Um, I have Schminky Antique Gold. We have the Amsterdam Deep Gold. 
we have the Old Holland Iridescent Royal Gold, Rose Gold by Prima, by Schminky, um, Matisse Metallic Light, PBO, Classic Gold by Schminky. Okay, this will be fun. Let's try Antique Gold. I go, I'll try to go, ooh. Try to, look at, it's very, um, I have my warm lights on, so, but it's very like pewter-ish, okay? All right, uh, it is antique -y. You can see that it has like a brownish um, tinge to it. Not really my vibe for this one, but that's cool. All right, let's pop on, I guess I should use different things, but let's pop on some Amsterdam. Okay, quite, quite red in comparison, All right? Um, Maybe a little too red for my liking for this one. Okay. Then we have Old Holland. I love Old Holland. Iridescent Royal Gold. Okay. Also quite... It's almost a little... It's hard to tell the difference between Amsterdam. It's a little more brown than the Amsterdam. Um, not sure if it's my vibe currently either. Okay. Then we will have the Schminky Rose Gold. I hope I find the gold that I'm looking for. We shall see. Schminky. I like saying Schminky, by the way. Okay. Uh, yeah. All oh, right. This is a little more coppery. Okay. Um, not my vibe either. Okay. And we have Matisse. All right, this definitely is a yellower gold. Um, so far, I would choose this one to paint, okay? Pebio. Very similar, Pebio is very similar to Matisse. Um, I'm still gonna go with Matisse as the winner so far. And finally, Schminky Classic. Schminky Classic. Ooh, okay. The Schminky Classic is the brightest of the light golds. So I actually am going Schminky. It seems more pigmented um, than the Matisse and the Pebio, Pebio whatever I yo. Um, so schminky for me, schminky classic gold is what we're going to paint with. All right, let's do it. Hello, welcome to this angle. This is my living room. When I hand paint, I usually like to do my living room. I can watch TV. Anyways, let's discuss. Uh, along with the gold schminky, I am going to be using... I thought it'd be cool to use the Triart Interference Turquoise. I love this for a tube interference. It's so much brighter, I find, than the Amsterdam uh, pearl colors. And I it does need a bit of substance. So I am gonna mix it with a bit of white. However, this is gonna take away from the sparkle a little bit, but we'll kind of play around. And just in case I want some pops of color, I got this. So I'm gonna just kind of like doodle and see what I can do.
Okay, I think I'm happier with her than I expected. I think this is what a Dutch pour is like supposed to look like if you do it properly. It just took me a bit of hand painting, but I like the gold and I'm gonna go resin it and under the resin, the gold's gonna look like, look it. I think I really like this choice of gold. Um, so let's resin it and I'll show you the final product. So here's a quick clip of me pouring my resin out. I just kind of gloop it on and then I take my hand. It was hard to do because I was holding my phone, but I schmooze it about. I like to use my hand better. Here she is resined up. I have to say, I really enjoy this gold. And I always think that like if something's ugly, sparkle will always make it better. I think my favorite section... It's probably that one. Is this the way I'm gonna look at it? Hmm. Let's see. I think I originally was like that. No. I think I like it more like this. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, my resin dried so nice. Look at that. Not one buble in sight. So let me know what you think. Head over to Garrick Brown's page for his video next. Um, was my hand painting worth it? Did I save my poor little Dutch pour? Let me know. Have a good day. Bye-bye.